Hello everyone, my name is Alexander Yankowski and today we will talk about Next.js setup. Our main goals for the session is to create a project and install Next.js framework, create a page to render it in a browser and figure out how to build and run the project in development and production mode. Ok, let's start. First of all we need to create an empty folder, let's call it starter. Let's go to that folder, create a package.json file. I will use yarn here, but feel free to use npm instead. We need to add required dependencies. Next stands for Next.js and we need React and React DOM because Next.js uses them as peer dependencies. Okay, let's open our project. We see it's empty and Next.js uses file system as a routing, so we need to create pages folder as our routing configuration. And let's add our first page. It will be index page. To export the page we need to just default export react component. And let's return just div with text hello Next.js. You can see that you do not need to import React as a dependency in each component because Next.js will do it for us. Let's add another page, call it About.js and do the same. Let's just return string about. Okay, that's it. Now let's take a look that we do not have any scripts to run our project. Let's add them. And to run Next.js in development mode, we need to add script next dev. To run our project in production mode, we need to use next start. And to build our project, we need to use next build. Okay, let's test it. We run Next.js application in development mode and our server is started on localhost 3000. Let's open it. Okay, that works. Let's check our about page. Okay, that works as well. Let's check out production version. When we start next start, we see an error because Next.js in production mode runs just a server and tries to serve a production build which should be in .nextjs directory. And we didn't create a build yet. Let's do it. Now we have created a Next.js build and we see that Next.js builds index.js, page builds about page and it also builds 404 page for us out of the box. Okay, let's start server now. Okay, that works. About page works. And let's check any unexisting page and we see 404 out of the box. Okay, that's it for this session. Thank you for your attention and see you in the next video.